Hey, I'm Dan Richmond, and we're back with another video. Let's go! Alright guys, so if you saw the video yesterday, it was the title, Should I Buy the Dip? Well, let me tell you something. If you didn't buy the dip, I think there's another opportunity coming up for you, and we're going to explore that in this video. So I was really, really bummed like a day ago where I missed this dip right here into the 6-7. We wicked all the way down, looks like, to 6-5, guys. And I thought this was like my last dippity dip I could buy. And so that's why I made the video. Should you buy the dip? Because I, I really thought that we're going to dip lower. And let me tell you something, guys. I really think we're still going to. So I'm looking right here to break this. Right here, this the 75749 area. This area is where I'm looking. If we break this area again... Or if we go down there and test it and then break it, I'm looking to buy in right around here. This 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 region. Um everybody's saying four cents is coming, so I just wanna say like um I might buy in this dip, but I'm still gonna buy in the four cent dip too. So uh it's called DCA guys. If you guys don't know about it, go check out the term, search it on Google. But I just wanna say that I, this opportunity right here was really good, the 6-7. And, and I'm just hoping I can make a comeback from that. And so how I'm looking to make that comeback, um, just to go over it again, how I'm looking to make that comeback is right here when we break this 7-4, 7-5, like around here. I'm looking to, to break down here. And then my price target for purchase would be Back around that six seven six nine region, um, I did say earlier on Twitter that I put in a buy order at six nine. Um, I it, it looked like sixty nine cents, but I kind of goofed up, and it was supposed to be the zero six nine six six nine, meaning almost seven cents. But um, I had a little typo there. So um, this is my buying region, and I hope that uh, we can get back to this. And then look, if we go lower. I'm just going to DCA in and buy some more. I'm always looking to add to my Hedera bags. But really, let's go over to Bitcoin and we'll see what's going on. Bitcoin is is about to half. If you guys don't know what that means, it all it has to do with miners. It basically means the amount of Bitcoin that's being produced is going in half. So, yeah, guys, go check out that. A lot of terminology on that, a lot of stuff to learn. So what I'm looking for is during this halving, I think Bitcoin's going to stay in this area, but I, I do think we're going to go lower. And I think when we do that lower, um, anything lower than like where we're at now, I do think HBAR will break that 7.5. Um, and then and then would be the great time to buy it. I'm Dan Richman. Uh, thanks for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what price you bought in HBAR at on this last dip. And I'll talk to you next time. Peace.